I'm Ben Micellis from the Midas Touch Network. Stormy Daniels is just ripping into Donald Trump, and I am completely here for it. On Twitter, Stormy Daniels has responded to all of the Trump trolls, just utterly exposing just even further how despicable Donald Trump is. Here's one of the things that she said. She goes, whoa, I never said it was an affair. I have said over and over that he cornered me coming out of a bathroom. Well, I guess to him that is an affair, seems to be his pattern. And this is one of a series of threads that Stormy Daniels has responded to over the past 48 hours. Let me just read for you some of these threads because I like to see Stormy Daniels fighting back, Stormy Daniels standing up and just showing what an utter complete clown, uh, traitor, idiot, just disgusting person Donald Trump is. This is what Stormy Daniels uh, writes to one of the trolls. Someone named Hockeyman19477 writes, but you had sex with him, so what does that say about you? Stormy Daniels responds, that I have a strong stomach and no gag reflex. Someone named Al Owen writes, you are a joke and will go down a failure. And then Stormy Daniels responds, anytime I go down, it is a success. This is a thread that Stormy Daniels responds to. And so the thread begins with Michael Cohen responding to someone named Robert Lustick, who says, Trump reimbursed Michael Cohen the 130 grand and he gave Clifford just out of the goodness of his heart. And Michael Cohen responds, the defeated former guy's statement has absolutely nothing to do with the well-established fact that he did, in fact, have an affair with Stormy Daniels. It's not even what the case is about. Either he's lying again or didn't read his own lawsuit or both. Then Stormy Daniels responds to Michael Cohen, Whoa, I never said it was an affair. I have said over and over that he cornered me coming out of a bathroom. Well, I guess to him, that is an affair. Seems to be a pattern of his. And then this troll account writes, Well, I wouldn't get my hopes up. She did deny an affair with him right here on Twitter. So here, this account visibility filtered is trying to say that Stormy Daniels denied having an affair with Trump. In other words, trying to prove what Donald Trump is saying is correct, where Donald Trump says no affair, this is extortion and no affair. By the way, as I've been saying here on the Midas Touch Network, I said I wouldn't consider the 1.5 seconds of sex or whatever the heck Donald Trump did as an affair. I mean, it was sex, but I wouldn't say that was an affair. And that's what Stormy Daniels is saying. Like, I don't consider what that was an affair. He like basically cornered me coming out of a bathroom. And I guess to him, that was an affair. That seems to be a pattern of his. And look, I think she is referring to the fact that he is involved as well in many sexual assault um, litigations, including one coming up by E. Jean Carroll next month. And I've also said, I think that a lot of Trump's statements that he's been saying about Stormy Daniels, where he's been calling her despicable, misogynistic names like Horseface, and he's been not been denying that he has even had an affair with her, or I guess even denying that he's had sex with her. I said, I think that's going to be used as evidence in the E. Jean Carroll case and potentially in other cases, because one of the things E. Jean Carroll's lawyer, Roberta Kaplan's done in the deposition of Donald Trump, she's pointed out that Donald Trump just claims that everything that's inconvenient to him or he doesn't like is a hoax. So one of the questions that Roberta Kaplan asked Trump is, OK, so climate change is a hoax the election is a hoax what else is a hoax russia is a hoax ukraine is a hoax oh and eugene carroll's a hoax and now she's gonna say i think when cross-examining donald trump when he goes to trial um as a defendant in the case brought uh, by E. Jean Carroll next month, going to show these messages. So you claim you didn't have sex with Stormy Daniels. That's what you've been saying publicly. Is that a hoax as well? I want you to all pay attention to that because I think that's something that is going to 
be asked. Anyway, Stormy Daniels then responds to the troll account and says, this one actually hurt me because I just face palmed myself so hard at the astounding stupidity of it. And what she's referring to is the astounding stupidity of this Trump troll account that's basically saying, don't get your hopes up, everybody. Stormy Daniels is denying that she had an affair with Trump right here on Twitter. Stormy Daniels is saying, whatever the hell that was that he did to me was not an affair. When he cornered me in the bathroom and had sex, that's not an affair. He had sex. He wanted to cover it up. He wanted to pay hush money. He paid hush money. Was that an affair? That's not an affair. That's why she goes, I just face palm myself so hard at the astounding stupidity of it. And this other, it's a, this account, crypto, F-V-S dot F, the ether, Chris, crypto, Voss, ether, wrote, did a post that her and said, Trump hit that with a bunch of uh, emojis. And then Stormy Daniels responds, hit is very dangerous. I'd say more like a pathetic thump, but whatevs, calling what Donald Trump did to her a pathetic thump. As I said, it was 1.5 seconds of whatever the hell that was. A pathetic thump is what she calls it. Now this other troll account goes, there's no proof that he did that though. That's speculation. And the prosecutor is doing it out of political prosecution. I used to know Stormy Daniels. I quit being friendly with her. Fun fact, she's an unfit mother who lost custody of her children. Stormy Daniels uh, responds, Buah, ha, 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 ha. I've never been friends with you or even know you. Definitely never lost custody of my child who happens to be headed to me from her dad's place with laugh emojis. These Trump people just make stuff up. And then this person goes, uh, post this meme. This you at Stormy Daniels, hi ho, Stormy, is a meme of Donald Trump like riding Stormy. And then Stormy Daniels responds, it is giving him a ride straight to jail. See how sweet I am? Oh, that's so good. And here's Stormy Daniels uh, responding to this account Trump isn't getting arrested, sweetly. And then Stormy Daniels responds, so he lied again because that's what Tiny said on his own social media post referring to Donald Trump as Tiny. And again, I think Donald Trump has opened the door as well for her to explain just how tiny he is um, when she had that 1.5 second thump of an interaction with him because he's going to deny that he even had sex with her. So she's going to um, have to testify about it during the, or likely to testify it during the felony criminal trial of Donald Trump. Mandy Bates writes, why are you so obsessed with him? Because he treated you like a whore you are and didn't marry you? Stormy Daniels responds, I only responded when he posts about me or talks about me on TV and only a fraction of that. He probably watches my movies on repeat, which may be why he has so many typos. Slippery fingers from Lube and KFC. So good. So what Quester writes at 45 Quester, that's the person's uh, Twitter name. How embarrassing. The person writes, what are you talking about? We have Hunter Biden smoking crack on video with prostitutes and minors. Trump sued Stormy Daniels when he left office, just as he said he would. He won his lawsuit. She was ordered to pay Trump $300,000. And she responds, can someone please show me where Tiny sued me when he left office? I'm sorry to think his supporters are competing in a secret contest for who could come up with the most ridiculous and inaccurate tweet. Well, I love the new nickname calling Donald Trump Tiny, but Donald Trump opened up the door for that. And yes, call him Tiny, call him a traitor, call him one of the most despicable people ever to live, which is what he is, a wannabe fascist, utterly reprehensible and vile. Really, really, really love these posts, though, by Stormy Daniels and wanted to share them with you. Hit subscribe. We're on our way to 1 million subscribers thanks to your awesome support. So please hit the subscribe button right now. Um, we're marching to 1 million subscribers in the month of March. Help us get there by hitting subscribe. Check us out at patreon.com slash Midas Touch, P-A-T-R-E-O-N.com slash Midas Touch. 
Also, wherever you get audio, just search Midas Touch Podcast and subscribe on audio. I'm Ben Micellis from the Midas Touch Network. Thank you for watching. Now, hit subscribe. Help us get to 1 million subscribers in March. The best part of waking up? Maggot tears in my cup. Check out the new Maggot tears mug available now at store.midastouch.com. That's store.midastouch.com. It's 100% union made right here in the USA. I know I'm not tired of winning yet. How about you? Get yours today.